somewhere hidden amongst thorny brambles is a little kingdom of elves and fairies. Everyone who lives here is very, very small. I'm Ben Elf. <coughs> and I'm Princess Holly. <coughs> Come on, let's play. Wait for us. <laughs> And Holly's Little Kingdom. Today's adventure starts at the meadow. Lucy's school. I knew this shortcut through the meadow wasn't a good idea. You'll be late for school, Lucy. Hehe, <laughs> but I love going this way. We might meet my little elf and fairy friends again. Lucy, the other day when we thought we saw elves and fairies. It was a very hot day, and I'm afraid we let our imaginations run away with us. There really aren't any such things as fairies and elves. Good morning, Lucy's dad. Ah, uh, good morning, little elf. Hi, Lucy. Hi, Ben and Holly. Come on, Lucy. You'll be late for school. Uh, bye, little people. I'm going to school. It's nature day. Can we come? It'd be a brilliant adventure. Yes. No, no. I forbid it. Remember, we mustn't be seen by big people. But I've seen you, and so has my dad. But you're nice. It's just other big people we can't trust. Oh, don't worry. I'll go with them and we'll keep well hidden. Hooray! OK, but if you do get seen, pretend to be a toy. Like this. I'm a toy. Yes, yes, whatever. Come on, Lucy. Say goodbye to your, um, little friends. Yes, Daddy! Quick, into my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Lucy. Pick you up later. Bye, Dad! <laughs> this is my school. Wow! So many big children. Stay hidden. We mustn't be seen. Good morning, children. Good morning, Miss Cookie. Today we are learning about wonderful things in nature, like Fluffy, our hamster. Who knows what kind of animal Fluffy is? A hamster? Yes, but what sort of animal is a hamster? Oh, he's a mammal. Is he a mammal? Yes. Well done, Lucy. Its proper name is Mesocriquetus. Auratus. Its proper name is Mesocriquetus auratus. Goodness! I think we'll just stick with Fluffy. <laughs> oh no! Gaston smelt the bananas! He likes bananas! Gaston, here boy! Stop! Come back! Nature is all around us. Like this pretty little insect. Does anyone know what she's called? Gaston, and he's a boy. <laughs> Very funny, Lucy. Is it a ladybird? Yes, or well, you could call her a ladybug. And what does she eat? Gaston likes pies. And spaghetti bolognese. Pies and spaghetti bolognese. <laughs> <laughs> no, ladybirds eat things like green flies. Let's keep the ladybird in this jar. Oh, no! Gaston's trapped. We'll let her go later. I hope Gaston will be all right. Don't worry. I'll get him out of the jar. But you'll be seen. It's all right, Ben. I'll be very careful. Miss Cookie, there's a fairy walking across my desk. A fairy? Let's have a look. Nanny, the teacher's coming. Pretend to be a toy. Oh, yes, I'm a toy. Oh, a little fairy godmother. Whose toy is this? Um, it's mine. Do you remember what our rule is? No toys in class. That's right. I'll pop the dolly in my drawer and you can have it back at the end of the lesson, all right? Yes, Miss Cookie. But, Miss Cookie, it was a real fairy. Thank you, Katie. Let's carry on, shall we? Ooh, what's this? She's got Nanny's wand. <laughs> it's sparkly. <laughs> That girl doesn't know she's doing magic. Miss Cookie, there's a frog on my desk. Oh, what? Oh, where did he spring from? Well, well, can anyone tell me what kind of animal a frog is? Well, it's 
a kitten. It's not a kitten. Oh, my goodness. It is a kitten. We have to stop her. I'll do a spell to lift the wand out of her hand. Uh, Zooby Zooby's air float in the air. Oh, dear. I didn't mean to lift her as well. Miss Cookie, Katie's out of her seat. Sit down, please, Katie. Good. She's dropped the wand. I'll go and get it. Wait for me. Miss Cookie, there's an elf and a fairy walking across my desk. Quick, pretend to be toys. What a pretty fairy doll. And a handsome elf. Are they yours as well, Lucy? Yes, Miss Cookie. I think I'll put these toys in the drawer as well. What are you two doing here? We tried to get your wand, but a boy saw us. Did you pretend to be toys? Yes, yes Nanny. Nanny. Good. Well, I think we've been very clever so far. No one knows we're not toys. But we're shut in the teacher's drawer. And we haven't got our wands. Yes. I think we'll have to call for a little help. Elf Rescue! Hello? Well, if it isn't Nanny Plum, let me guess. The big children have seen you, you've lost your wand, and you've been locked in a cupboard. No, you've got it all wrong. We've been locked in a drawer. Oh, all right. I suppose I'd better rescue you. Elf Helicopter is go! I'm on my way. Sit tight and don't do any magic. He's on his way. Lucy! Psst, Lucy! Oh, hello, wise old elf. Are you here to rescue Ben and Holly? Yes. Watch an elf ninja at work. Oh, bother! Miss Cookie, there's an elf on a string. Oh, this is an odd-looking doll. Yours as well, Lucy. Uh, yes, Miss Cookie. I'll put this funny-looking goblin in the drawer with the rest of the toys. Funny-looking goblin? Funny goblin? Ah, it's the wise old elf, here to rescue us. Yay! Uh, yes. Hello. I never thought I'd be so glad to see you. What's the rescue plan? Uh, Will you make a hole in the drawer with a special elf rescue drill? Uh, no. Getting locked in the drawer was not part of my plan. It wasn't? No. It's all right. Lucy's teacher will let us out at the end of the lesson. Home time, children. Oh, oh Lucy, let me give you your toys back. I said it was risky. But, oh, no, you don't listen. Oh, it's all right. They all think we're toys. Oh, uh, guys! <gasps> oh, I must have imagined it. Right, um, here are your toys back, Lucy. The pretty fairy, the handsome elf, the fairy godmother and the strange old goblin. Madam, for your information, I am not a goblin. I'm an elf! Oh, well done, wise old elf. So much for not being seen by big people. Now Miss Cookie knows about us. Don't worry, I'll sort it out. Hello, Miss Cookie. You must promise not to tell any of your friends that you've been seeing elves and fairies. No, I promise I won't tell anyone, any of my friends, that I've been seeing elves and fairies. Thank you so much. Bye. Can I have my ladybird back? Your ladybird? OK. <coughs> By the way, he's a boy and he loves spaghetti bolognese. Don't you, Gaston? <coughs> Bye. Now I've seen everything. Cheerio! Hi, Dad. Hi, Lucy. Good day. <laughs> Great. So what did you do at school today? Uh, well... Bye, Lucy. Can we have our wands back? Of course. See you again soon. 
Cheerio, Lucy's dad. Uh, Cheerio. You'll never in a million years guess what I saw today. An elf in a helicopter. Don't tell me. You've seen them too? Um, yes. Maybe we should just keep this between ourselves, eh? Yeah, good idea. I think we got away with that. Only a couple of people saw us. Lucy. And her dad. And all her friends. And her teacher, thanks to the wise old elf. Yes. Maybe we should just keep this between ourselves. Mm, yes. What's it worth? 